Hey YouTube, this is W7MBP. Hey, if you get a chance, please hit like and subscribe. This video is over the QRP tri-band vertical antenna. Um, comes in a kit, it's $20, and I'm not, you know, big into soldering. Done a little bit of it. Um, it's kind of intimidating, you know, the first time I did some of it, but this is fairly easy. Actually, Ham Radio Crash Course, if you go look on his YouTube, he has a step-by-step -step video where he's sitting and drinking the beer and soldering and putting this kit together. That's what I did. I just watched his video. It was excellent. So there's not a whole lot of soldering here. So like these, the, these end pins, those are just holding it in. They're not actually, you know, a wire-to-wire -wire connection. So you've got two here, two here, one over here, one over here, and one comes in over here. So not a whole lot of um, soldering. You do have to write, uh, wrap the toroids, and if you'll just sit down and, and wrap them and, and count it, it'll they'll take you five minutes a piece. They come with everything. Like I said, um, uh, Ham Radio Crash Course does a really good video. So what you do on this, let me flip it over. Um, it's, it's, it's pretty self-explanatory. If you want 20 meters, you flip this over here and flip this switch over here. 40 meters here, here, 30 meters here. So it even says right here, you cut a 17 foot piece of wire. And then these are radials off here. I put five radials, uh, put them in here. So not much to it. So here's the wire I ordered to run this. Um, I guess it's they said it's good up to 20 watts. So you can get 250 um, feet of it for what, 23 bucks. And then the uh, QRP guys website, you can order it, just go through PayPal or whatever. It's 20 bucks. They've got um, a really good uh, instructions too. Again, on this wire. So this wire feels like a rubber band. I can fold it. Let's see. I fold it right there and it doesn't really kink. It just lays out, you know, really easy. So, um, when you're, when you're stretching it out or you're laying out your radials, you know, it's not all kinked up and you're trying to get the kinks out. You just, you know, you just pull this out I'll give you a good illustration on it. So it's not all kinked up. You know, it, it'll lay out really well. This is the one thing that I would really advise is this wire. Again, I'll put it in my uh, description if I can figure out how to do that. But again, guys, hey, thanks for watching. Hit like and subscribe. Um, I don't, um, I'll try to get this antenna and what I want to do, I was, I'll probably put it on my 7300 and put 10 watts on it and start doing some uh, WJTX, and then I'll um, I'll log that and, and do another video. I think, you know, that's usually what everybody's curious about. I also, um, on eBay, um, I got this. This is just a fishing pole, and it's just a Chinese-made fishing pole. Um, it's upside down, sorry. But just ordered it off eBay, and it just... It goes out to, I believe, um, uh, 21 foot. So, like, this is 17 foot, so you need to hoist it up on that, so it makes it pretty easy. Again, hit like and subscribe. I really appreciate the view. Uh, if you got any questions, let me know. And, like, again, I'll, get, I'll try to get a performance video up. Thanks a lot, 73.